Hey everyone, welcome to this HitLights video on bypassing a ballast in a fluorescent tube fixture to help accommodate more energy efficient LED tubes like this one. Have you ever been in a room that's fitted with fluorescent tubes and noticed that it takes them a few seconds to flicker on? Well that's actually because the ballast in these fixtures has to kind of jumpstart each fluorescent tube by sending a big surge of power to each one, which is what results in that initial flickering. Business owners will tell you all about the pains of ballasts, including extra energy costs and relatively low lifespans if you turn the lights on and off frequently. However, with an LED tube like this, they'll actually instantly turn on with no flickering and no ballast involved at all. So while bypassing your ballast may seem like a bit of a chore in the beginning, an 18 watt LED tube runs at about half the wattage of a comparable fluorescent tube and can last up to about 50,000 hours, so it'll greatly save on maintenance and repair costs as well. It should also be noted that this wiring instruction is for our standard LED tubes, and UL LED tubes will follow a different process than you're about to see. First, make sure that the electricity to your fixture is turned off and that it's safe to work with the wiring. Then, you'll disconnect the black and white AC wires in your home from the matching black and white wires on your ballast. After you have those disconnected, you can fold the black and white wires on your ballast out of the way because you don't need them anymore. Next, you'll need to cut the red wire that runs from your ballast to the side of your fixture. You'll need to make this cut in the middle of the red wire so that you can connect that red wire to the white AC wiring coming from your home. Then, you'll cut the blue wires that run from your ballast to the other side of your fixture. Now that your ballast is completely disconnected, you can fold the rest of the wires attached to it out of the way. And then we'll take the two blue wires in your fixture and attach them to the black AC wiring coming from your home. This will be the neutral side of the fixture. And now you're ready to test the lights. If the light turns on when tested, you can take it back out to cover up the ballast wiring and wrap up your installation. For any more information on LED lights or accessories, please visit www.hitlights.com. You can also like this video or subscribe to our YouTube channel if you need any more LED tips and tricks.